How you doing everybody on YouTube? Um, this is Donnell, and I'm just going over um, the new update I just got today, the Gingerbread 2.3.4 on my Atrix 4G. Um, so far, so good. A lot of big changes going on here. Um, at first, I'm going to start off with the notification um, draw, drag down. I like how that is right there, how it goes from, you know, light to dark, like that. Um, it's pretty cool. Um, I, I got, you know, there's a couple widgets I have up here. The, um, this is my Google Plus widget. Um, if you have Google Plus, you can add me to your circle, Donnell Parson. Now we got, um, as you can see, the message, in the, the message icon is a little different. I like the way, you know, it's really responsive. Now these right here, these are stationary. These four right down here. And you can change those to whatever you want them to be just by long pressing them. If you long press them like this right here, then, you know, you can search, you can, you know, change it to whatever, you know, whatever you want it to run. I don't know if you guys can see that, the four down here. Um, this is your application tray right here. It's a little different there. Um, one thing I really like is I, I really do like the the gallery right here. Now I'm still getting the still trying to get the hang of this because you know it, it actually I think it's um is actually showing you pictures from your Facebook friends, um, people that put up people that put up pictures already. Um, and you can click on you can click on your own library, and it brings up you know all vi all your videos or all your photos, which is you know it's very nice organized. If you got videos on there, and you got you know your photos, so it's pretty cool. What else? We got um you know your Google Plus, your Gmail. It changed changed a lot of the icons. I like how they look, the web browser. This this one right here is your web browser. And it's 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 really it's really great. Um if you in how it turns off is pretty neat too. When you you know the standard, you know, the gingerbread you know, old television turn off. <laughs> one thing that I do have an issue with with the four G with the Atrix four G, um I'm I'm pretty sure a couple people might have had this problem. Sometimes when I scroll over, sometimes it does take a while. Right now it did it pretty fast, but sometimes when I when I un do the unlock screen, sometimes it takes a while for it to go to turn the phone on. I don't know if anybody else has had that problem, but I had that problem. It's just annoying. Um, I'm noticing that. Um, I haven't had it. Actually, I haven't really had it since I updated it. So maybe they might have did a little fix in it. Which would you know? Which would be very nice because I hated that very much. Um, I'm not sure about. I haven't checked out Skype yet. If you can use Skype video calls with it, I didn't see anything on there. I don't know if that's something that Skype has to you know has to fix, but I haven't seen. I haven't really been able to make a Skype video call yet with the with the Atrix. But so far, this is. A really good update. It's, you know, it's moving a lot faster. I haven't did a bench. I haven't done a benchmark yet on it though. One I um, there's actually a widget that actually doesn't work on the phone anymore. I don't know. I don't know why, but it's the it's a Motorola widget. I don't know if you guys can see this, and it's the I think it was the the date and time maybe the date and time. I think they actually changed a little bit. Cause now, maybe not. I mean, it's this is still showing up there, but I I, I could have swear at one time I was able to resize it to to you know to go like this, but it doesn't let you do it anymore. I'm I'm, I'm almost positive, you know. Sometimes I I just you know jump from upgrade to upgrade and don't even pay attention to sometimes things that are being upgraded. But it was a pretty. Actually, when I did the uh, um, the upgrade today, 
it actually kind of took a long time. It paused. You know, I don't know if it paused. It just took. It was a kind of a lengthy process. So if you do the update, just you know, let your phone let it do what it's gonna do, and just be patient. You know, go. You can actually probably go take a shower by time. You know, do whatever dishes or whatever eat, and then you know it'd be done. Because if you stare at it like I did, it takes forever. So you know, you're just waiting for that update to come on and finish loading up and everything. So. You know, every, like I said, everything so far is really smooth. I'm loving it very much. Thanks to Motorola. Uh, thanks for checking me out. Subscribe. If you have any questions or want me to try anything um, with the phone, you know, I give it a shot. I'm not scared to. I'm not scared of breaking my phone or I don't know whatever. Just holla at your boy, and um, we'll work it out. All right. Thanks for watching. Don't forget, add me on your Google Plus, Donnell Parson. Throw me in your circle. If you need a friend, if you need a um, an invite, just let me know. My, my um, you can actually search for me by email also. That's dlpiece2 at gmail.com. Thanks.